Hey everyone, now I'm going to discuss the problem E2 from good first round 690. So in this problem we are given an array and M and K two numbers. Okay, so what you have to do, we have to select M distinct index such that the maximum element among those minus the minimum element among those should be less than equal to K. Okay, we have to print the number of way we can select this. So let's see an example that okay just an example that we are given six element and the value of m is three and the value of k is two okay so if we pick one two three it's a better answer because maximum is three minimum is one so it's uh, less than equal to k if you pick one two five the maximum is five and the minimum is one so uh, we cannot uh, we, we cannot select that because uh, the difference should be less than equal to k the difference if you select 1 to 5 the difference is 4 is greater than k we cannot select that so so here is a good couple of uh, here is a good observation is that we can think think this problem like that we have to select m minus 1 el m element so for example if we if we select the first element as 1 and and now we have to select m minus 1 element and and what is the maximum element we can select if we select the first element first element as one the maximum element we can select is one plus k equal to three so so if we select three we can also select uh, two because uh, the first of all we short the array because uh, because we, we, we have to just select m distinct index so the order doesn't matter that's why I just short the array and find the upper bound of 1 plus k so in this range in this range we can select four element we can select m minus uh, uh, we can select m minus one element from four element so it is just 4c m minus one if you select the first first element as one we have to count that uh, 4c m minus 1 it is the number of element number of way we can select the first element as 1 okay if we select the first element as 2 what will happen the maximum element we can get is 2 plus 2 is 4 uh, we cannot take 5 because the it, it will be um, greater we maximum element is is 2 plus 2 to 4 so we just we have if we select 2 then we have 3 element and it will be 3 C M minus 1 if you select 3 and we have 3 element because we can we can take 5 because 3 plus 2 equal to 5 so we can take 5 we have to select 3 element and it is 3 C M minus 1 so it is it is clear that we have to just iterate through every element of the array and find the upper bound of the array for example for the upper bound for one is three the upper bound is two is three but upper the upper bound is three is five just find that and apply the ncl law so that is it i see the uh, now i show the implementation part I just first read the array and short short the array. I just first the find the upper bound of the array, and I select uh, I select the first element as eighth element, and I have to select just uh, m minus one more, and I sum up all the answer. So that is it. Uh, uh, that is it for this problem. Thank you for watching.